one cool thing about this hostel, it was in a old, um, what do you call it? Um, it was in an old um, courtroom. So this is one of the rooms here. I'm trying to talk quiet because this room echoes like crazy, but that is where I guess, um, I, not a judge, but a guilty party would sit. And then here you would have, I guess, a jury. You would have, um, you know, other people here. You'd have an Ursha over there. You'd have a probation officer somewhere over there. You would have people here in this area doing some sort of job. And then you'd also have, um, I guess, witnesses and more people back here. But nowadays, um, you know, there's a foosball table. Photography and tape recording are strictly forbidden. We don't have to pay that any attention. But I really like the old style of this place. Though. They've kept it the same. They've kept it the same a lot. This is one of the courtrooms in this hostel. I'm going to take you to another courtroom here. But first, I'm going to grab my stuff really fast. This place is literally like a maze. This is the front office. And then here is the TV slash TV courtroom. And it's another one, but this one is slightly different. And once again, I'm talking really soft because it echoes like crazy in here. But yeah, check out this courtroom. They're all different. <laughs> this thing even has prison cells. Prison cells, showers, toilets. I think it's funny it says prison cells, and this is a new. So they purposely put that there. Yo, New Yorkers, I bet you know what this is. This is no peeking, but look at it. You know how in New York they have these things all over? You can charge your phone and surf the web. Looks like they're putting them here too, but they're trying to hide it. No peeking. Of course I'm gonna peek. Or I'll just think unzip, but that's super cool. This this thing has Wi-Fi in New York, so my guess is it'll have Wi-Fi here too. Yo, 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 another day, another adventure with your homeboy Jermaine and getting this vlog started off. I am looking for money exchange, but I'm having a hard time finding money exchange because today is like a Monday right after Good Friday. No. Today is Monday, right after Easter Sunday, so there's a lot of banks and a lot of money exchange places that are closed. And I've literally been walking for an hour trying to find one. Now, I did switch neighborhoods. I was staying in um, a neighborhood about maybe like two miles like north, and now I'm staying near the London Bridge. And in this neighborhood, I can't find any money exchange place open. In that other neighborhood, there was tons of money exchange places open, and they're open all night long but over here I'm not finding anything like there's so many places that are that are just closed I mean the Starbucks is open but you know Starbucks you know can't really help me right now anyway yo let's get this video started all right they told me money exchange is this way but this is like what the London Stock Exchange group no that's not what I'm looking for hopefully this place is open it doesn't look like I'm gonna find a money exchange place over here. But this is the way the guy told me to go. Good news. Yes, I was able to switch out dollars for pounds. So I have more pounds, which is a good thing. I don't have to use my card because a lot of places, you know, a lot of little hole in the wall places don't accept cards. So you just need pounds and I got some more pounds. So now I'm just gonna go, uh, gonna go do a little bit of exploring around this other area here. Google Maps is telling me to go this way. I tell you, this is a beautiful way to go. Wow, there are cameras everywhere. One, two, three, four, five. This is probably the most surveillance country in the world. Like everywhere you go, there's a camera looking out. So you wouldn't want to commit any crimes here because you have a very high chance of getting caught because there's so many cameras they can follow where you go 
So if you take off running and you go this way, well, they can follow you wherever you go, even when you get on a train, because once you get on a train, there's still cameras in the station. There's cameras all over the city, like everywhere there's freaking cameras, which is kind of smart and kind of scary at the same time. I'm curious, what do you guys think about all the cameras? <laughs> there are crazy amounts of cameras in this country, but uh, it, it doesn't exactly creep me out too much. So I noticed around here they do this a lot, like there's construction going on in this building, so they have like the sheet up that looks like a building and windows. It looks really creative actually, really, really cool. And that's like a normal building.